So to start this one off, you guys find yourselves no. in an interrogation room, but you're not sure why. Rub your heads, all you guys can think is what's going on and what went wrong. It's obviously everything, we're in jail. Well, how'd you guys get here? I mean, I had like 30 bodies in my closet, so uh, I don't know, yes. maybe someone found it. I don't know. Tax evasion. So as you guys are sitting in the interrogation room, its door opens, but instead of the usual detectives, you see men in suits. It's Batman. Batman. You see Batman come in, followed by me, also in a suit. Kurt, you're like, one of the feds? What? <laughs> uh, hello, everyone. Look, I got a level with y'all. Uh, y'all know me as Kurt. You know, your fun old a retro nah, member. Nah, nah. A, a cap stands no. for, ah, Kurt's a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> ah, like, y'all know me as Kurt from Recro, but I'm also part of this organization called the SCP. Scoop, set, scoop. Thank you, Den. Anyways, the organization dedicated to securing, containing, and protecting anomalous artifacts and phenomena. And I'll be sure y'all y'all joining is the only way I can get you out of this situation. <laughs> How did we get arrested? I don't remember. That's what I thought. You guys were found in a field with 18 dead bodies. <gasps> Oh, the field shit. had weird carvings in it and everything. It was the whole weird deal. It's a part of the unexplained. And if we're being honest, I I don't think y'all did anything. But you just said we shouldn't be here. Then why why the are we here then? Here? Because they don't know that. I'm trying to help. I'm a B-class personnel. I got a little clout in the SCP. So I propose we bring y'all on as D-class personnel. And that's a way we can get you out of the situation. And maybe in the meantime, figure out what actually happened to y'all. Because I'm pretty sure it is SCP related. Can't I just pay a bill? You think we got money? You are on death row. You are so privileged, Chili. You are on death hey. row, bro. <laughs> hey, sp hey, sponsor of this video. Bail us out, please. We got to do your ad read. Y'all's job under this new special D-class personnel is to investigate our new understandings of anomalies in SCP. I'll be putting you in SCP encounters, and if you survive and with new intelligence or confirming our intelligence, then you will be a little bit closer to your freedom. And it gives me more time to investigate what actually happened to y'all and those dead bodies. What's the difference between this and death row. You don't survive death row, Chili V Panda. You, you die. You can still die here too. I'm with it, officer. Take these handcuffs <sighs> off me. No, welcome to the SCP D class. And now it's time to take you to your first assignment. You guys are lifted off into a helicopter and land near a local Ikea. Let's go! Swedish meatballs with lingonberry <laughs> sauce. Let's go. Gross. It looks like a normal Ikea, but there are a lot more men with guns outside. Bro, what? Specifically because this Ikea is considered SCP-3008. It's an Ikea. Yes. <laughs> People go here to buy furniture. Uh, coats. So your assignment is to test one of our scientists' theories about 3008. What you'll be doing is going inside, picking me up this shelf, and proceeding to check out before closing time before that is 10 p.m. That is crucial. Do you guys have this in a different finish? I don't like- You don't like the cherry one? No, I want it in a neutral gray. I'm starting to think this is, uh, these are chores? <laughs> I think these are chores. <laughs> okay, and, and just one any itsy bitsy little detail, uh, if y'all just happen to not make it out before close, the only time you can go back to check out is between 6 and 9 a.m. Oh, and another rule, don't bring any new people with you. Kurt, this is an Ikea. Why are you making it sound like we're walking Who? into some dangerous... Uh... Yeah, it's an Ikea. Who's new people? It's an Ikea. Who's new people? It's just us. Anyways, I push all of you in the store and the <laughs> doors automatically close. Okay. Uh, good luck, guys. Go get my shelf, please. Thank you. So all we have to do is grab the shelf? Easy. All right, so... Who is I just like to mention, uh, I always get lost Who in these, is... so give me a minute. Who... I have to get my bearings. Who is new people? There's directions on the floor. Follow the arrows. Uh, uh, so you guys have two options. Do you want to go straight to the shelf aisle or explore? Who is new people? What? 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 There's people in the Ikea, Chili. What? You're, it's an Ikea, Chili. Why would we ever want to leave with yeah, them? So what am I going to pick up girls here? I mean, you could. <laughs> is that what you mean by don't leave with new people? Can we explore so we could go to the food court? I go, I go to the bed frame aisle. There's a girl there and I go, ha, huh, we could test this at my place. <laughs> <laughs> I hate that, man. All right, what time is it right now, though? Yeah, uh, it's currently 9 p.m. Ah, fuck, we have no time, Curtis. I say we grab the shelf and just fuck around near the checkout and just check out. Ooh, true. Well, the think, shelves yeah. are usually near the, the checkout. Are you an Ikea uh, connoisseur? <laughs> Take me <laughs> no. to the shelves. I 
what? We're going oh, to the oh shelf. Fine. Great. I'll pocket yeah. some spoons on my way. You guys walk over to the shelf aisle and pick up the whatever shelf the I told you to grab. Umlavat. Okay. Wait, why don't we go to the, the return aisle? And return the shelf? And then get a discount shelf. Oh, that is an anomaly. Why Ooh. don't we do that? You want to do that? Let's go. Let's go. Let's get the cheaper discount shelf. Discount shelf. No, no. Make them spend money. Why are we giving them discounted? Make them spend it's money. It's going on my card. He didn't give us any money. Y'all are D class. You don't get, you don't get SCP I gotta get funds. Come on, man. <laughs> my points don't stand. You got to buy this on commissary money, yeah. bro. This is great. Man, life, life is such a fucking drag. Damn. So now with you guys' new shelf, you had to return to get a discount. But on your way, you pass where you came in from and the exit is missing. Oh, oh don't worry. We're just at a weird part of the store. <laughs> I haven't, God damn it, we're yes. lost I'm yet. trying to follow the arrows, Den, but they keep taking us to a wall. You guys look around the Ikea a bit more and see that it just keeps going. Oh. This is what all of them Are you like. kidding me? Aisle by oh. aisle by aisle by aisle by aisle. It seems to keep going. Guys, this going. is what they all feel like. We just got to keep walking. Honestly, better than a cell. We might as well stay here. No, I want to get out. I don't want Swedish meatballs. Yes, you do, Dan. No, gross. Would you guys like to climb the shelves to see uh, <laughs> if something's up? Or maybe you see if you can find <gasps> the exit? Yes, I want to. I don't mind living in a house with 20 sinks. So I'm going to just chill. Chili climbs the shelves. Like a monkey. Chili looks up and sees that it really doesn't end. Whoa. But she does notice a bunch of smokestacks coming out from different parts of the store. Okay, I hop from shelf the top of the shelves to get closer to the smoke. They seem miles away. What? As you try and go closer and closer. That's all of them, guys. <laughs> this is what they're Who's all been, who this shit up, man? Who? Why? <laughs> you guys are hopping on top of the top of the shelf. Fuck. And you do see uh, someone in a striped polo. It looks like an Ikea worker. Fucking nerd. Striped polo in 2021? <laughs> Fucking idiot. Wait, don't make fun of him. He works here. We got to get out of here. How long was I in jail? How how long was I in jail? <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> the angle's weird, but he looks like a tall, bald man facing away from you guys. So you have the option. Do you want to get his attention or no? Yo, ref, can we... <laughs> Excuse me, sir. I, I have a pocket full of spoons, Ivan. I can't hide I this shit. I won't tell him, Den. I promise. Anyways, I'm going to ask the nice worker how to get out of the endless Ikea. Um, actually... I don't know. <laughs> Why not? I have this feeling this is a bad idea. Hey, Baldy. I don't trust your intuition. Christian, please ask him where the exit is. Hey, Baldy. Uh, okay, never mind. So I, uh, I yell, hey, Baldy, and then I jump to him and I slap the back of his head. Like, <laughs> what the and fuck? And I go, hey, yo, where the, where the hell are you? Would you do Getting this? his attention by doing that, he turns around. He's not human, is he? And he has no facial features. Uh, I knew Okay, it. well, then I look at his face and I slap the front of his face, <laughs> too. <laughs> He's super tall, standing at a, almost like seven he's feet. His Swedish. arm reaching hey. beneath his Why knees. Why should Kill O'Neill working at IKEA, man? You look at him even straighter, and he doesn't say a thing. Not that he has a mouth to say anything. Can with. we ask him what his skin routine is? It's so smooth. Ah, uh, true. <laughs> After asking what his skin routine is, he simply walks away. And he's not helpful. Bye. This is the worst employee ever. <laughs> Where is your manager? He is the manager. <laughs> He walks away and disappears around a corner. But getting help from him is the least of your problems because you look at the clock and it is 9.59. What? A minute before closing time. We gotta get time. the fuck out of here, um, man. Yay! <laughs> no, this is a Mr. Beast staying in Ikea 24 hours. With challenge. faceless man? No, I don't want that, please. That's Mr. Beast. So you guys pull up to the bed section of the Ikea. And now you have two options. You can keep looking around. Maybe keep looking for that man or an exit. Or you can rest here. Maybe wait it out till it gets closer to closing time. I'm just gonna sit here. Chili, we have no idea where we are. So what are you gonna do? We gotta find Mr. Beast, who somehow evolved past the need for senses. <laughs> yeah, Mr. Beast I need to look here. for more spoons. <laughs> Mr. Beast is in here he's, somewhere, he's, bro. He's, he's here, man. <laughs> we gotta find Mr. Beast. He's filming the 24 hours in Ikea channel. He's here we somewhere. We gotta get the fuck out of here, man. All right, you guys uh, continue walking around, and then 10 p.m., uh, finally hits. All the lights turn off in the Ikea. Oh, man. Good night. <laughs> oh. Now, like, still looking looking around, stop and see the man that you guys are following, like, deep, deeper in the Mr. dark. Mr. Beast. He looks at you, but this time you hear words. He speaks. <gasps> what does he say? What, what, what does he, he say? say? He says in a very calm voice, excuse me. <laughs> 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 we, are, <laughs> we are now past closing time. Can you please leave the store?
He then begins sprinting oh, at shit. you guys at what? full Yo, speed. No, no, sir. You guys take off, and now you have two options. You can either go left towards home decor, maybe use something for protection there, or to the right to returns and exchange where you're going to go initially. Where are we going? Return and exchange. We got go to go to exchanges. Exchange. You guys take a sharp cut towards returns and exchange. But as you do, you see more of these monsters coming out of different aisles from varying heights of 7 to 10 feet chasing you. However, as you're running, you come across one of those smokestacks. It looks to be an amalgamation of a bunch of furniture made into some type of structure. There's a man standing outside of it, and he looks at you, shocked, saying, what are you guys doing out at night? Get inside, hurry, hurry. He's got a face? He has a face. It's a normal dude. It's yeah, a I normal dude. Shit, you got a face? It's been so long since I've seen a person with a face. He tells you, yo, get inside. You can either trust the guy or not trust the guy. Trust. Slap him, Christian. We got to make sure it's a real face. <laughs> <laughs> I slap his face and he goes, ow. Like, you felt that? Cool. Right, I could trust you. You guys run inside the structure and they close the door behind you, saving you. And you notice it looks like there's a whole society here. <laughs> In the Ikea. Listen, I know Ikea is big, but what? <laughs> Swedish meatball lovers. The man who brought you inside looks at you disappointed, saying, what town are you guys from? Ta uh, jail. Wisconsin. Jail. He, he looks at you and says, wait, you guys are from the outside, aren't you? Wait, isn't everybody here? <laughs> Obviously, it's what? a whole society. Yeah, you were born in Ikea, so you were built? Oh, shit. <laughs> all they know is Ikea. <laughs> he begins to explain that all the people here were on a random Ikea trip, but got trapped in here when the exit disappeared and learned that every time the store closed, the workers would politely ask them to leave while trying to kill them. So they had to make these little townships to try and survive together. So you guys tell him that you're a part of the SCP Foundation. They've instructed you to get to checkouts with this shelf between 6 a.m. and 9 a.m. Because apparently that's the only time the exit will appear. Now the man interested in leaving this hell says he can help you and he knows the way to get the checkout. So it'll be a very long journey, but he can get you within the time frame. So you have two options. Do you want to trust him or not. Why would we say no? No, this sounds shady. Would you rather live with the faceless seven foot tall men? Remember when they said we can't bring new people? <gasps> Yo, Wait, I forgot about they them. did say that. This That's, is uh... shady. Wait, this is shady. Um, what we can do is we can betray him. No, we just like, we just trip him before we have to leave. So he just Dan like- Dan has a pocket full of metal spears. <laughs> Those are easily uh, weapons, yeah. So y'all and the man take off on a very long journey, but eventually you get to check out and see the exit is surrounded by these men. Can we capture one, put on their uniform and blend in? So I actually, we go up to them and we go, you guys can take your lunch. We got it from here. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> Let's do that. The man directs you to where a bunch of dead workers are and you put on their costumes. All right, it's time. Y'all then walk up towards the exit, closer to the employees. We start treating them like old friends. We're like, hey, Bill, how's the wife? I can't help it. I just keep slapping their face. I can't help it, bro. While you guys are trying to walk through the crowd, they all kind of look at your group as you guys are walking. And then one of them steps in front of you and says, excuse me. What? It's past closing time, you know. Oh. He raises a hand and grabs Chili by the throat. Oh, shit. <laughs> he raises his hand at a woman? <laughs> oh, shit. What? These are oh, bad news. Oh, shit. Oh, record him. Someone he record him. Yeah. Wait, I, I, haven't re I haven't recorded him. I haven't recorded him. He grabs Chili by the throat, and Christian gets grabbed by the leg. Oh, shit. What's going <laughs> on, man? Excuse me. I'm um, dying. <laughs> this is not how you treat your customers. <laughs> we just came here for a shell. Customers always <laughs> right. Excuse me. Ivan and Den like swarm their way and then they, they get really close to the exit. Uh, but it seems like for Christian and Chili, things aren't looking That's good. That's fine. They're not us. We're going out of here. Hey! Damn, what? What is this betrayal? Everything seems bleak for Chili or for Chili and Christian until the guy who brought you jumps on them oh, shit. and gets you guys free. All of you guys start booking <gasps> it to the exit. Bye -bye. Let's go. You guys are all Let's right go. next to the exit and homeboy is reaching out his hand. He's like, help me, please. Come on, we gotta get out of here. You guys, one last option. You can either abandon the guy or let him be there. No, bitch. Bro. I kick I him straight in the chest to push him Kurt, back. I was about to abandon all my friends. I'm not going to stay for a stranger. I take Ivan's phone and I start recording him. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. You want what? Help me. Help me. I'm like, what? <laughs> I, I reach for his hand and I pass him a spoon and I say, goodbye. Good there luck. Is. Good luck. <laughs> He's like, what is 
What? I help you, please? And that's a drink there. See you later. I need my promotion. The SCP told us not to. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. He's like, what? We're a part of the I, system I, I, now. <laughs> He's yelling, and I'm like, I'll just stay here with you. And he goes, out. Oh. <laughs> no, it's majority rules, Christian, and all of us leave. I record you guys. I'm recording Dad you. Dad carries him with his spoon. <laughs> you are all holding Christian down. He has his phone like, I got you on camera. I got it. I got it. I'm going to cancel you later. <laughs> you guys uh, run out, sprint out the exit, and then you see me in a black suit just going... Congratulations, Fuck guys. you, traitor. Fuck you, Kurt. Kurt, I got you the lowest quality shelf. I hope you don't appreciate it, and it falls. I, I hate yeah, you. I slap you in the face. I hate you, Kurt. Oh, I also want to slap Kurt in the face. Let's I go. I slap him in the face just to make sure he's real. <laughs> but before you slap me, you see the man crawling out of SCP-3008 with one of the employees grabbing him, pulling him down, reaching out. I'm almost there. Please. And then I shoot him and what the employee the fuck, in the head. Kurt? You really are a fan. <laughs> God Bro, damn. I got that um, on video. I arrest Kurt. All this for a Sorry. SCP regulation for this test said nothing but the test subjects could exit the building. SCP does stand for so Kurt's a pussy, man. This is fucked up. So yeah, anyways, bitch. I got my spoon back. Bro, I'm only class B. That's what the class A's wanted. There wasn't anything I could do. Kurt's just an asshole. Asshole. <laughs> asshole. Asshole. Yo, y'all got my shelf, bro? Why did you send us to this Ikea? It's cool. It's Cool. Researchers said that this shelf lets you exit the building at very specific times. And also, they said I could keep it if y'all brought it out. So, yo, thank you. For Bro, I hope, that, I hope this shelf gives in when you put it up, bitch. I, I grabbed the you. gun and I shoot Death myself. stabs you with her spoon. Oh, that's crazy. You guys get escorted to SCP headquarters awaiting your next assignment as D-class personnel. This is bullshit, Take me Kurt. back to my cell. Thank you for doing SCP. Take me back to my cell. I don't want to do any more missions. Recreo, out. <laughs> nah, but we didn't get out, though. Uh, Chili, the store closes at 10. I hate Ikea.